Thanks for stopping by, guys, and welcome back to Stormworks for yet another battle video. Today, we're going to be taking out two experimental tanks. On my side, we have the Mark 31, which is, well, you'll see it's basically built around the idea of battle cannon, fragmentation rounds, and hive survivability over what you've seen previously with the missile carriers that I oh so love and might return to in the future. On the other side, we have a first generation tank built by Shadow. Is there anything you want to say about the tank before we actually get going into the battle, showing off some stuff and... Um, not much about it. It's very rough first gen. This is the N1 Legion, uh, which is already in the works, being replaced by a new modification of it to make it a little smaller, heavily, more heavily armed. Mm -hmm. Just the general upgrades, and it is sliding backwards again. Um, you anyways, generally speaking, not much to speak of. A little bit underpowered on the engine, but it's, functional. like I said, first gen. Um, its only real benefit is that it's very high fire rate on a uh, heavy auto cannon, full fragmentation belt. Oh, so you uh, are using fragmentation. Yeah. I was talking to I was talking to Panzer, talking about the different shells, and figured that fragmentation is probably my best bet. Because even if I don't pen, you run the chance of messing up different optics, and basically mm -hmm. anything that's on the outside of the tank, um, which is kind of what I'm gambling on with it. But yeah, overall, it's I mean, it's an improvement over my first prototypes with the oh. God, what are they called? They're the E1 uh, T1 Kodiaks, which maybe at the end of this I'll pull out to show, but they are really, really bad. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, that's basically a general rundown. So the fragmentation rounds, I, I've been messing with like armor penetration, seeing which rounds do best with certain things. And... When it comes to the compacted armor we've been building for tanks, it seems fragmentation for a battle cannon can penetrate five layers, whereas an armor piercing penetrates six. I'm not sure what that is for heavy auto cannon, because I've kind of written it off a little bit as being too weak, especially for use with fragmentation. But I'm actually curious how that how that'll do on a heavy auto cannon. Yeah, I'm actually curious too. I've since this is first generation, first tank combat I've had. Um, I don't really know what to expect with it, but I'm just hoping benefit of rate of fire might help. Mm -hmm. So, all right. So with a little bit of a look at these two tanks, let's go ahead and get them prepared for actual combat, and we will see you all in a second. All right, and we're ready for round one in three, two, one, go. I just noticed a pixel that's out of place. Ah, it's gonna frustrate me. Um, oh well, it's the it's the light right there that has the dark camo. When it, that one has the wrong camo. Too. <laughs> Both oh, of those have the wrong camo. Ah, it's frustrating. Anyway, um. It's going to bug me really bad now that I've noticed yeah. that. Okay, there we go. Um, so the main issue with the Mark 31 right now is that the, the sight, I haven't finished the sight, so it's just using the laser pointer that the yeah. um, so the Mark 26, the missile carrier used, because the gun was not the main weapon on that vehicle, but this one, I have the, the big cannon and the MG are the only hey. two things on this, though. So. Yeah. Oh god, this thing can get some airtime when it moves. It doesn't get up to speed fast, but once it gets going, whew. Oh yeah, the wheels the wheels are good at like preserving momentum. Yeah. Dude, this is God. The last time I did this was oh it was scrap mechanic. What was I using? I think it was the Apophis I wanna say it was the Apophis Mark IV against I don't remember what yours was. That was ages ago. I don't. 
because that like, was... Unfortunately, I don't remember a lot of like the old battles and the old tanks. God. Ah, uh, did you get my gun? That's a problem. Hey, why, why no turn? <laughs> did I hit your seat? I don't know. Oh, I see a fire, it looks like, Bruin. Either that or it's your welder. Oh, that's a fire. Okay. Oh, give. 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 Wait. I'm sorry. Nah. Yeah, it's already shot. <laughs> uh, yeah, this thing has no, uh. No protection whatsoever. There goes the gun I went down. Yeah. I am noticing I'm not getting fires as often with fragmentation. Oh, no, there that's... we go. I spoke yeah, too early. Fun. Yeah. Well, that was fun. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> you admitting oh defeat so soon? What is that doing? What is that doing to my... <laughs> Your machine gun just wedged me down in my turret basket. <laughs> Yeah, unfortunately, there's not much I can do that I'm aware of. Not much recovering. <laughs> nah. This thing All has... Right. I need to move into, um... Uh, WSD guidance. Or not WSD, jeez. Um... Mouse? Mouse. So, because the biggest thing was, like, I saw you first, and when I went to try to engage, I hit my turret control, and the whole thing just had a freak out. And my whole, uh... Jeez. I need to armor the breach, too, it seems. I wonder if I can... Ow. Yeah, literally... Yeah, literally Flash that hatch. Ah. Oh! Oh! Oh, my God! <laughs> Are you alive? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got my... Ow. Jesus. <laughs> Sir, I don't speak French. I can only say surrender so many ways. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. And we're ready for round two in three, two, one, go. Yeah. And yeah, no, like you're saying, I mean, that's most or ch big chunk of the point of um, doing combat is to actually see how the tank functions. Yeah, practicality rather than it. just in theory. Because in theory, yeah. every tank is amazing and would win every war, but right. when things start shooting at you, plans fall apart. Yeah, it's all fun and games to you kick the hornet's nest. And unfortunately, I, I've tried taking, like, my tanks to the AIs to, like, shoot at them. F I'm not sure what round they have, but almost all of the ground vehicles that the AIs use are either too stupid to shoot at you, or they have the rotary cannons, and they just go burr. Of course they do. Dude, you know what I miss? I miss the days of gaming where AI were... Dang it, stop it. Stop cranking. Please. Thank you. Jesus. Uh, uh, no, F is not the button I want to hit. Jeez. Holy crap, that's fast. What? I can't even see you. What do you have your zoom set to on that? Holy Jesus. I'm not using the camera, I'm using third person. <laughs> Dude, I'm in third person as well. I can't even see... Oh, I can see a tiny little red dot. <laughs> My camo good? I, I keep hitting F when I try to tab out. Yeah, your camo is good, it's just... 
Stop it! <laughs> oh my gosh. No, you do have a really good camo, though. Oof. Saw that. <laughs> I don't like that. Guns too high, guns too high, guns too high. Hey! Hey! Oh! oh my god! Oh! We're still going! Why am I driving in circles? Why am I driving in circles? Because I think I damaged your steering wheels there. Oh, you... Yeah, you took out my, uh, <laughs> seat. Mm -hmm. Ow. That was my skull. I don't think you're, uh... <laughs> oh! You're still firing. You aren't on fire, so that's 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 gonna be a problem. You're gonna have to address at some point. Yeah, at some point. Ow! Stop it! Oh, sweet Jesus! I think that was a direct hit. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Your ammo cooked off too. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, and we're ready for round three, two, one, go. And I had mentioned before to Shadow that I've been messing with artillery guns. Um, I've actually built a few newer tanks than this one that I'm using, but this is the only one I've like finished to completion so far. Um, the other one actually does use an artillery gun. It's a f uh, what four tall turret is the thing though. It's really top heavy, and it looks really disfigured when you have the width limit of 17. It got the Swedish treatment. Oh god, the, the like... The SGRV uh, 74, I think it is. I don't know that one. It's... Once we're done with this, take a look at it. You can put a picture of it up on your video or whatever, but basically it looks like an M41 Bulldog that someone just messed with the aspect ratio on. Oh, is it is it the one I'm thinking of that has like a 103 and it's just... No, no, no. It's got like a long barrel 75. It's at like 5.0. Uh. Yeah. That... I'll, um... I'll put we'll, a we'll figure it out. And, yeah, it's... Oh god. Because there's one yeah. I'm thinking of that just like the entire turret comes to a point where the gun sticks out and it's just like a giant turret on top of what looks like an armored car chassis. Oh, I know the one you're talking about. I Somebody just shot at me. <laughs> That's me. There's not many other people shooting at you currently. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I noticed that. <laughs> The I'm unfortunate not thing is, is, like, one of the big designs for this is it does have the anti-radar flares. Yeah. Um, however, currently nothing is pinging me with radar. No missiles. Yeah. So, wait. At the moment, radar tracking turrets, like, um, aim assist is not allowed? Uh, they can be used to help with target acquisition, but they can't, like, auto-control the turret. Got it. So, you can't set it up to just be like, hey. Aim fire. All right, got a few hits in. Come on. Oh, wait. What happened to my... What is... Is that what the smoke grenade is? I was like, I think you got my... What did you get? Because I'm suddenly not able to drive. My engine's operation. No? Oh, no, my turret just bugged out. Okay. Or my, uh... How did you get my wheels on the opposite side of my tank? <laughs> I don't... <laughs> what? What, you... what black magic is this? Fragmentation.
<laughs> Wee. I don't know if that hit or what happened. Ow, that one hit. <laughs> oh no, they've 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 been hitting pretty uh pretty true. I've missed a few. Hey, my don't gun's still wrong. operation. Oh nope, I have no traverse. And my engine's on fire. Oh. <laughs> God, one of the shells is in my laser. <laughs> of course it is. So I think this is pretty conclusive. Ow. <laughs> uh, and that was my ammo. Yeah. That's that's one of the things about All the right. auto cannons is their ammo is actually explosive. <laughs> Yeah. That's one of the downsides of using them. That's why I didn't actually put one on this. Nah, I got you on that. Yeah, I mean, it performed a little bit better at that time, at least. It's kind of really just like learning. Fragmentation. Yeah, frag is. The stuff that is pulling off, it's like, Jesus. Did I get anything damaged on your tank? You shot me in the side skirt. Um, let's actually see. Uh, it damaged my side skirt, but didn't seem to actually pen through anything important. Let me Got see it. if it did anything. Interesting. So heavy auto, uh, heavy yeah, auto it, shrapnel doesn't do much. Yeah, it literally just hit my side skirt and it absorbed, the side skirt absorbed everything. Hmm. Good to know. So it has a penetration of like... All right, and that is going to be the last match for this video. We're going to take these back to base, do a little bit of testing, see how much punishment they can actually take from each other. And with that, I think we're going to end it off here. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for sticking around. And until next time, peace. Ow. Stop it. Oh, sweet Jesus. I think that was a direct hit. <laughs> Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs>